So sometimes when I get a YouTube idea in my head, I kind of get obsessed about it. I started thinking about how much fun it'd be to get a catapult and shoot some melons out of the catapult and then shoot the melons out of the air with a shotgun. So I started looking on Craigslist and there actually was a catapult for sale. It was actually a trebuchet, which is a type of catapult. And so I decided, this is it, I, I need to do it. So I went and I met this guy and he is exactly the kind of guy that I would imagine would be selling a trebuchet. He had a fedora on, he had little bitty spectacle glasses on, and he had a mustache that he had waxed into a little ring on both sides. And uh, he was really nice though, really friendly. Um, but anyway, he wanted 50 bucks for this trebuchet and I talked him down to 40 and I took it home. I worked on it a little bit, I beefed it up a little so it would, it would fit my function a little better. And uh, we took it out and shot it and uh, it didn't really go as planned. My shotgun was messing up. We also had trouble hitting the um, bottles out of the air. They have a very funny flight trajectory we weren't very used to. And then we didn't get enough shots because the trebuchet broke. We put a little too much weight on it. But here's the footage. Here we go. More weight. <laughs> yeah. That was better. Maybe we just need more weight. All right, added 50 pounds, got 140 total. Let's see it. <laughs> What? <laughs> right on your head. That's gonna be awesome. That was the best one yet. Yeah. Does he have his stuff on? Hey, Rowan. Say hi. He's able, he can't hear us, I bet. Hopefully. Boom! Oh, yeah. I did it again. Boom! Someone else shoot this thing. I think that one went further. <laughs> Put too much weight on the trebuchet. Hey, Jimbo, uh, will you come pull for me? Yeah. Just like a, a moderate speed of, uh, of... So anyway, you can see that is less than ideal. Um, but I have rebuilt it. I have made it stronger. So we're gonna have to try it again. Here it is in my garage. Put some new boards on the bottom. Much stronger than they were before. I've also fixed this. There's no way that chain's gonna pull through these 2x4s. Much stronger. So the trebuchet is ready to rock. I'm going to take it out next weekend to uh, do round number two. And I think we're going to have a much more successful outcome, but there's only one way to find out. So uh, you guys on YouTube, stay tuned to Demolition Ranch.